Hello and welcome to this video where I'll be showing you how to link your Google Authenticator to KuCoin. So before we get started, give this video a thumbs up. Have you done that? Okay, let's get started. On your smartphone, launch your KuCoin app and sign in. I've already signed in. So click on this profile icon here. Then look for security. Click on it. Here you will see Google verification. This Google verification is showing not configured. So click on not configured and code will be sent to your phone so some people used to find it difficult here that they don't receive the code or they are still looking for the code they don't used to receive the code you have to click send first when you click on send now the code will now be sent to your phone so the code has been sent as you can see it's saying 57 seconds that before i can be able to resend and i've received it already so let me go to my message now so here you can see say here is the code so I'll click here to copy and I'll go back to my cool coin. See? So the code has been entered. So now to proceed, I'm being asked to download Google Authenticator. So if you already have Google Authenticator installed on your phone, you don't have to download it again. But if you don't have, just go to your App Store or Play Store and download the Google Authenticator app. So I already have it. I will have to click on already installed to continue as you can see here. I will just click on it. Here's my own private key. So if the Google Authenticator is on another phone, I will just have to use the other phone and scan, choose the scan QR code option. And when I scan this, this code here will be entered automatically. So here, I don't have my Google Authenticator in another phone. So I'll have to copy the private key. Let me click on copy. As you can see, I've copied it. So now I'll go to my Google Authenticator. Look at it. So here, I still have other apps already installed on the authenticator. So I will now go to this plus icon here. This down plus icon. I'll tap on it. So here, here is the QR code option that I said you should use if your Google Authenticator is on another phone. But if it's on the same phone, just proceed and enter the private key that you copied. So here now I'll click on enter setup key. So here I'll be asked to enter account name and the key that I copied. So here I will name it CoolCoin. You can just uh -huh, cool coin here is it then here i'll have to paste the private key that i copied here is it paste so here is the key so here you just have to leave it to be time based and then click on add so here as you can see cool coin has been added so now for it to start working you need to go back to your cool coin so here you can see click on next hmm? So here, I'm being asked to enter the two-factor code that I will see in the Google Authenticator. So now I have to go back to my Google Authenticator and then copy this code. So here, pay attention. This is where some people find it difficult. This blue round thing here is reducing. It's just like a timer. Once it times out and you have not input the code, the code will give you error. So you have to wait and copy it when it's fresh. Okay, now here is a fresh one. As you can see, it's reducing. So just press and hold on it for like one, two seconds. Then go back to your cool coin. As you can see, it has already entered it automatically. Just click on activate. So that is it. As you can see, Google verification has been activated. Here is asking me to change. So that is how to do it. So that is how to link your Google Authenticator to KuCoin. If you find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel, and I will see you in the next one.